ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಗುರುವಾಯಿರಪ್ಪ ಪೂರ್ಣತ್ರ ಈಶ ಮೋಸ್ಟ್ ರೆಸ್ಪೆಕ್ಟೆಡ್ ಫ್ಯಾಮಿಲಿ ಮೆಂಬರ್ಸ್ ಮೈ ಪ್ರಣಾಮ್ಸ್ ಟು ಈಚ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಎವ್ರಿ ಒನ್ ಆಫ್ ಯು ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಡಿಸ್ಕ್ರೈಬಿಂಗ್ few points very systematically knowing pretty well that many of you are not deeply understanding the indian heritage in it spiritual aspect psychological aspect physiological aspect social aspect anthropological aspect and many other aspects including economical so india is a country which lived on the surface of the globe earth according to archaeological evidence for the last 10000 years archaeological evidences based history starts in india right from 8275 bc onwards plus 2000 ad is equal to 10 millennia and in india absolutely no religion we have dharma the way of life the method of life you know on the surface of the globe here there are nine religions the one hinduism is not a religion is a dharma which we call sanatana dharma dharma word means what is protecting you what is guiding you what is directing you that is dharma sanatana word means never it can be destroyed always present here so sanatana dharma is what is available at present in india it is the way of life ayurveda is also a way of life yoga is also a way of life chanting a mantra performing puja are all part of this way of life method of living and india is the only country where this dharma has got nearly 1200 and 80 fundamental literature just like christians have got bible muslims quran and so on but in sanatana dharma the foundation literature 1280 plus 10000 commentaries in sanskrit plus more than 1 lakh commentaries in non sanskrit languages and 1280 plus 10000 plus 1 lakh that is the literature treasury of india these literature written during the last not less than 8000 years including the oldest literature rigveda last not less than 8000 years after that continuous addition deletion modification and corrections were done i would like to repeat that four english words in indian literature continuously addition used to be done whenever the subject become obsolete deletion used to be done wherever modifications are required modifications are done wherever the thoughts become irrelevant and wrong their corrections are also done so addition deletion modification and corrections were done continuously 
and every one had the freedom to do this also it need not be a super sanyasi who can do this addition deletion modification and correction in india we have never said only my opinion is correct in india we have never said only my religion is correct in india we have never said only my method is correct and in this country we have never prevented anybody for opting to different versions in this land we always allowed freedom of thought even from sanatana dharma buddhism came up and jainism came up sikh religion came up we nurtured never prevented never stopped never put any hindrance on that so the knowledge was continuously evolving out and we integrated the ancient knowledge and the modern knowledge integration of ancient and modern integration of the old and the new integration of the experienceable knowledge and experimentable knowledge integration of the spiritual knowledge and the scientific knowledge integration of the physical knowledge and the spiritual knowledge and as swami vivekananda said what we need today is the integration of the eastern knowledge and the western knowledge i repeat that statement integration of the eastern knowledge and the western knowledge that is the answer for the 21st century and as far as you are concerned i wish wherever you go collect as much information as possible collect as much information as possible convert the information into knowledge convert the knowledge into wisdom convert the wisdom into experience and the totality of the experience should be your life repetition collect as much information as possible purify the information cleanse the information and convert the information into knowledge further purify the knowledge then you will reach to the wisdom further purify the wisdom convert it into experience and the total experience in your life that will become your totality of the life or the life as such always remember that preparation for living is not life experience of living is life preparation for living is not life experience of living is life preparation for learning yoga is not yoga experience of getting yogic feeling is yoga we may be learning continuously yoga but that is not yoga experience of getting the yogic feeling that is yoga and ayurveda is also not the preparation for learning it but experience of adopting and adapting the ayurvedic knowledge that is real ayurveda in fact the west always looks from outside but in india we always look from inside somebody asked indian rishis could make so much knowledge but why they did not discover the gravity sir isaac newton could find out the gravity when one apple was falling on his head or nearby that and he could easily find out there was a gravity from apple what indians were doing indians were not looking the way in which apple was doing indians were looking how the apple seed was sprouting the small seed was there inside 
when one drop of water was falling on that or water is falling in that, it start coming up. The plumule, the radical, how the cell division takes place, how the cotyledons are coming, how the tree is growing, how the flowers are coming, how the pollination takes place, how the apple tree is coming and how the sweetness in the apple tree is coming. We were looking into that internal aspect of the seed.